shit, what's going on though? I need a feel for y'all boy to watch this video though. I need y'all boy to like, comment, subscribe. Appreciate you. Motivated family. What's happening, man? I know where you're heading for, man. We out, y'all. And then, let's go to old Monday. You know, we kind of out early. I don't know when I'm going to drop this video, but it's going to be later on. I um, decided to take them on a walk, and I want to take them to the park. Dig and can't really, like, take all of them. You know what I mean? So I just bring um, Sky and Luna out. You know what I mean? Because I want to shoot the video, so I can't shoot all, all the dogs and try to hold the camera. Dig what you be like that sometime. You dig like I don't get a twist like I do. Like it's just not me. I mean, like I got a good support system. I mean, my wife helped me out. Dig what I said. My kennel partner helped me out. I mean, so and I get um, I get a lot of insight from some of the um, some of the viewers that I stay in contact with that um, that help me out. Give me some pointers or whatever. And, um, yeah, man. But besides that, we out here. You know, Sky doing it good. Feel me? She had a little, um, I gotta watch her a little bit. You know what I mean? She had, I starting to see like a little, a little problem with her. Thanks. I wanna, um, keep my eye on, out on that and, Close friend of mine told me what it could be, you know. So I'm not gonna put it in the in the universe like that, cause I don't want. You know what I mean, if it's not that, then I don't want to go ahead and put that on her, you know. So that I'm watching out for that, you know. But for the most part, she's doing she's doing good. Man, I just gotta I think I gotta exercise her some more, or don't exercise her. As much, they gonna say. So right now we at this, we at the park. They don't normally go to the park, you know what I mean. So this gonna be their first time. Actually, like going inside the park. Come on. You can see how this works, but they don't know where they're going. Now yeah, hold on. Okay, so we inside the park right now. Y'all can see the park. I'm just gonna like walk them a little bit and I got a, got a couple people out here. So I wanna do like some shots with them. The right thing, which I think it'll be nice. You know? So I don't know. It's crazy because when people see like a, a, a bully or whatever, it's like they really they get it mis get it misconstrued with like a, a pit bull. You know what I mean? And like it's a it's a different it's a different type of it's a different type of vibe when you're dealing with a bully and a pit bull, man, because a bully was bred to like have that have that look, right? That intimidating look, right? But a bully is really like a gentle like a gentle giant, you know what I mean? Until like it's tempted or whatever, right? But like um a pit bull was bred to be aggressive. You know what I mean? A pit bull was bred to be a fighter. You dig what I'm saying? A bully was not bred to do that. A bully was bred to be a companion. Or whatever, right? Like, I can, I can trust, I can trust my dogs, I can trust my bullies around kids or uh, like strangers or whatever, right? And of course they're going, they're going to get, um, antsy, that's the right word I use, and they're going to get, um, antsy, whatever, they're going to have like extra excitement with them, you know? But as far as me thinking like they're going to hurt a child or whatever, I don't, I don't think so. I don't see that. These big so like and the bully like the bully has a different look from a purple terrier. 
Like, the pit bull terrier has the terrier look. Like I said, like, even though the bully came from the pit bull terrier and the Amstaff, right? And later, later on, um, they added some, some people added some bulldog to get the bully, the bully, uh, uh, more, uh, more bully a look, right? To add mass to it, but too much of the bulldog will mess up, and I mean, the actual features of the American bully, right? So the, um, the American bully, even though, again, like, even though it came from the terrier and the am staff, they breed it, they breed it away from the terrier look, you know what I mean, and they wanted more of that bully, that bully look, like you see a freaking, a big bull, you know what I mean, like a, a, a cow type thing, they wanted that look, you know what I mean, they wanted a more solid, more masculine look. Dig what I'm saying? And I feel like you can tell, uh, you can look at a bully, right? And be like, okay, like that's a bully. I mean, because of the shape of the head, the the chest, I mean, the hind legs, dig what I'm saying? The tail, I mean, um, and a terrier is a more, is a more slim dog. I mean, and I think like, Besides the slimness and the all-around look, right? Again, you would tell a bully from a from a um from a pit bull, and like that's like to me, like that's where everybody get the game messed up at because like um everybody would be like, oh, you got a pit bull, so you you have to like explain to them this is not a pit bull, this is a a bully, right? And no, you don't like you shouldn't get upset because a lot of people like a lot of people don't know that there's a difference between an American pit bull terrier and an American bully. There's a difference between a bulldog and an American bully, an American pit bull terrier. Even though like um they bred it or you breed two certain things to get a certain look. I mean that don't necessarily make that dog. Uh, that you know what I mean? Like it don't make like these are not pipples. These are American bullies. You know what I'm saying? So I just sometimes like you really gotta like sit back and like explain to people like what it is. And you gotta be like patient with people, man. Like just because a person don't know, you know I mean, if a person don't know, then you should be the one to like inform them like, hey. This is, this is, this is what it is, you know? You don't gotta be a, a freaking, a dickhead, excuse my ex expression, you know what I mean? You gotta be a dickhead about the situation, man. Just sit them down and just, just be like, hey, I know that you heard that this is, um, a pit bull, or you think this may be a pit bull, but it's not, you know what I mean? It's a, um, it's an American bully. And that's like anything that you do, like in life, you know, it's like you, you um you be patient with people. If a person don't know, you be patient with them. You know, so it's not for us to dang on, especially in the bully community with every with us being um like a rebel type of community because like we um we branched out to our to ourselves kinda and we trying to we want to hold this hold this luck and hold this, this community down with a righteous one, you know what I mean, so, I just feel like a lot of, sometimes a lot of people give these dogs, or the, or the, um, our community, like a bad look just by the action that another person might show towards you, I mean, or a dog might show, you think all the dogs are the same, but it's, it's not that, you know what I mean, just because you have one bad experience from another person, I don't mean that like every single person gonna be like that. Okay. I think they're really enjoying themselves, man.
I really think they're having fun. Yeah, for real. So I'm gonna try to um get some nice shots, man. So y'all hold on for a minute. There you go. Now y'all can see them. They're kind of hot too, so I'm gonna um. I just wanted to like do something different, you know? Versus having them having them inside the like giving y'all the same thing every single day, you know what I mean? Like I just like man try to bring them to the to the park and see what happens, man. You know? So hope y'all enjoyed this video man. Until the next time man, y'all boy new tomorrow, man. Be great. Stay motivated. Yes, sir.